Welcome back. Yes, welcome. We're glad to be here with you. We're very I'm glad. So happy tonight. Yes. So we actually, in all of the kind of bad news that's been happening lately and all the craziness in our world, we actually have some good news. That's why we're positivity from the porch, right? That's right. That's right. Can so, I tell them, Julie? I, I can't wait. You got to tell them. This I is can't wait news. either. Okay, I'm tell them what's, our word, what's my, our word of the week. Oh, the word of the week is vaccine. And I got my first shot yesterday it was a piece of cake i didn't even feel it no after effects although they make you wait a while to see if there is and the nicest doctor and staff at iu north in carmel and i am so happy i am halfway there my appointment for the second one is three weeks from now and I have to thank my daughters, Diana and Julie. They started it all when, <clears throat> before the governor came out and said that he was going to let people 80 and older go for it. Uh, they were already looking on the internet, and I didn't we have a going crazy. Diana's in South Carolina, <laughs> yeah. and she was on it, and I was trying to uncover and contact anyone yeah. I knew. I'm asking for forgiveness of all. <laughs> well, you you were busy at and it, I'm telling you. And I am some phone numbers. Yes. Pardon? I got, we had an internet blip there. So, but I'm just saying thank you, all my friends who yep. I bothered incessantly because we were so desperate to get mom the vaccine. Oh, my I sister know. Diane was calling. We had brother Mike, even from Nicaragua, yep. calling people in Florida. And we were trying to what? uncover. Way. Guess what? They both got a shot uh, <laughs> date for me to go in on the same day at two yeah. different places. And First, it was funny. And, yes. and it was before the big uh, dirge of people were going to go. Somehow they connected. And I think they were bugging them a long time. Anyway, to make a uh, short story short, even shorter, I got the shot yesterday. I'm very grateful and happy. And I just hope that we all of you can get your shot very soon. And we can be safe again sooner than later. Amen, Mama. There's a picture of oh, Nancy yes. getting yes. the shot. I yes, was yes. there. We want to thank IU North. If you're in Indianapolis area, IU did an awesome job from yeah. start to finish. It was Wait. so seamless. It's a well-oiled machine. We didn't wait hardly at all. We had time with the nurse. That's right. And he explained everything. And, and then we had the wait. And it was very clean, social oh, distance. Yes. So I posted it all on Facebook for all the yeah. details if you're in Indiana. And that the hardest part about, I think, right now what's going on is every state is different. It um, is, yes. It's, it's and difficult to know. And are having a lot of problems. Uh, for example, New York, uh, they have a very large supply. However, uh, it hasn't gone out to people. And so I think they're going to start now. And that'll be a good thing. Uh, yeah. We're so blessed. Of, yeah. We, we are we, so blessed. Instance, yeah, and every state is different. And we'd love to hear from you. We see you all in the chat. Richard, Tom, Elaine, great to have yes. you. Let know you're here let us know what's going on in your state yeah because yeah. it does very greatly and i know i've got friends in florida and it's just so different down there it's kind of a big mess right now with everyone trying to get yeah. the vaccine and it it's held up you know, too. What the statistics it, it are. doesn't hurt to be old the older the better I, it's, I a to be old. it's a perk to be old right now and yes yeah. yeah. But I think the recommendation that I would make is definitely contact your health department in whatever state you're in and get on their email list because they send updates. Oh, and please. actually, I actually got an email the day before um, from Indiana and was able to get on before all the rush crashed, you yeah. know. So it's just, you know, it, every state is different. So you have to check. But I'm just so grateful that mom got the vaccine. Uh, yes. Wanted to 
be our word this week because we think in our day right now it's a word that represents hope. Yes. For healing, and we need healing right now as a nation. Oh, and this do. Is on it's all a fronts, real it's blessing, it's Julie. Yes. and it's it really a miracle for them to come up with this so quickly and right. something unknown, something so bad. Uh, you know. It's it's just a miracle, I think. Mm -hmm. I'm very grateful. And yes, also, me too. Uh, if people all over the country are going to get it. And I'm just waiting for the day when we can go back to normal, when we can see each other, go yeah. out together, not have to worry about this. Hug and, each other. <laughs> and, uh, yes, hug each other. Oh, I miss hugs so much. I oh, know, me too. I'm, I've always I'm been gonna, a hugger. I hold on, I got to hug that. My I'm getting licked. I, oh. I hug my great big football player, high school students going out the door sometimes. Nowadays, I'd probably get arrested. But in the <laughs> 20 years ago, it didn't matter. I mean, I just, I love to be close. And yes. I love to... To love each other too. My we husband, to by the way, got his shot today, and he's feeling good. How is that? How is that feeling, Mom? Because I know you didn't have any side I, effects. This is thing I zero. Could not feel, I couldn't feel the shot when it went in, and then when I got home, I was anxious to see if I'd feel it. Then I didn't. I looked at it last evening to see mm -hmm. if there was a mark or blood or anything because i take a blood thinner and nothing nothing it was like it never happened it was like yeah maybe that's a moment. yeah mm -hmm. but i know it was real <laughs> yeah it so, was real i was there i took pictures you definitely got it mom yeah I know. so let's talk a little bit about the vaccine because there are some people who are resistant to take it and we definitely were not in that category we were so no. happy counting the days we were fighting to get mom the vaccine that's to go right. back February 2nd um Tom actually Tom our brother Tom works for Pfizer and yeah. I'm sure it's discouraging because less than 30 percent so all of these people have worked night and day to get this vaccine developed mm -hmm. using a new technology it's called yeah. mRNA and it's a super you know it, it's just so fascinating how technology works because in the past, it would take 10 years to create a new drug. That's and I used to work with my Lily. And yeah. this new technology expedited it. And the hard work of all these employees at Pfizer and Moderna. And so they have all these vaccines, and now they're just sitting there. And yeah. it's got to be frustrating. And yeah. so, um, well, so I be think one the of the people uh, working with that, too, as soon as the uh, big, big uh, amount of people get theirs. He's going to be right in there, too. And I'm so proud of him and happy for him, too, Julie. So right. tell us Carol, your experiences, my friend Carol. if you've had yeah. any uh, with the vaccine yet, or what your hope is. I could mm -hmm. give you a few of my years so that you could be in with one of the first batches here. <laughs> I've I know. I think we're hoping I could slide my arm in there yesterday, but I wouldn't do that. There are people who need it before I do. I, know. I like what Carol said here. Um, they're talking about opening it up to 65 and older in a couple weeks. I heard that on the news. So the news, one yeah. thing about this whole vaccine is it changes daily. Like yeah. last Tuesday, Monday and Tuesday, again, I was just, I'm sure annoying all my friends in the healthcare industry. How can I get the vaccine for mom? Just sending yeah. these messages. Out. And I felt so discouraged Tuesday, and then all of a sudden Wednesday, I remember yep. saying a prayer, yep. and the government made an announcement. It's just like the waters opened, yeah. and that's when it all changed. And so this is yeah. changing daily, and so yeah. we just have to be very diligent until then and safe. Um, yeah. You know, and it varies by state. Like Carol mentions, Florida here. You know, it's there's so many elderly people down there too. So there's just a oh, huge yeah. influx. So yeah. mom and I were actually going to go to Florida we Saturday. Were. Yes. But we are delaying the trip because mom needs to get the second vaccine here. Oh. We are not leaving the state of Indiana It'll until be a she better has trip after I get that yeah. second shot. And right. And we keep I hope that Julie can get hers down in Florida. Yeah. 
and yes. everything, as Julie said, happened so suddenly. All of a sudden, Diane called and said, Mom, I've got you a place. <laughs> I've got you a, a time. I mean, it just, and who <laughs> she was. From South Carolina. From so, South uh, Carolina. And then, crazy at the same time, Julie picked up the appointment here. So, yeah. it's, uh, yeah. it's something it's, else, anyway. Another so, one of our blessings. Chalk yes. up another one. Yep. A God moment and an answer to prayer. I, I mean, I prayed. I said, Lord, yeah. okay, some help here. And the, on Wednesday, I prayed that the government opened it up to 80 plus year olds. Yeah. And then I said, okay, let's pray the next day. And that's the day that yeah. both Diana and I got the appointment. Well, it so, was so only yeah. right that the first responders and the medical people got it first. They're right on the line dealing with COVID patients. And they should get it first, Julie. Well, absolutely. I didn't, I didn't want it then, but glad now. Anyway, absolutely. And, and we so great. Comments here from some of our friends. We oh, do. Yes. We've got Tom and Carol yeah. and uh, Richard. Lots, um, lots I like to stop to it. All another of you. God moment. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Amen is right. This might be a short but sweet porch cast but uh i don't think anybody's dancing tonight are they julie there's no dancing tonight you're still in recovery and by the way not only this was a big week for dancing grammy not only did she get the vaccine <laughs> yesterday but today we went back to the doctor to check her broken vertebrae in her back and she is all healed the the doctor yeah. gave her a go yeah. you can even take the brace off so it's been a big week of healing oh, and our I and know. our family, and we're just hoping and praying that that healing can have a ripple effect out. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So that other people can get it. Oh, I have to show your little card. So upon getting the vaccine, you receive this. That's right. It's a card. I tell you to yeah. take a picture of it. Yeah. And it has the date for your second vaccine, which is very I important. Know. And it's and Pfizer that's... right on there. So you want to be sure, by the way, to get the same and and. You know, they they should schedule it when you're there, but yeah. you want to keep with the same company. If you got the first one from Moderna, you need to get the second one. And if you get the first one from Pfizer, you need to get the second one from Pfizer. And here's a really important thing that I don't know that people realize, but the nurse really clarified it. So once you get the vaccine, it doesn't mean you're immune. In fact, right. mom, you are not immune right now. You cannot leave the pink palace. I, <laughs> I you order you to send that, Julie. Um, I think you mentioned need, that a bit. Yeah. Yes. That, that you can't, You the immunity is one week after the first dose, you have about a 50% immunity. And then after the second dose, there's another week lag before you have the 95%, but you still yeah. can be a carrier. So, so guys, it's, it's protection, but not yet. We have yeah. to still be diligent and, and, and keep our loved ones safe and stay home. Yeah. And, and you can still be a carrier. So, so we just yeah. need to hold on for a few more weeks. Oh, I look at, we got Mike's on here. So That's glad that you got the vaccine. Yeah. You can do it. Now you just have to keep Ed home. <laughs> Mike. Hi, Take Mike. Keys. Take the uh, keys. Noah yeah. sign in so happy for uh, your good week. Uh, it was a very nice. good help. And we're just nice. so grateful. And, and Carol. Richard, yes. oh, I know you from lots from of friends. The Bible study. Yeah. He's oh, all excited to see everyone and Elaine. So we're just so grateful. And there's Richard again, Zoe. Yes. Oh, we've got so, a big crowd, Julie. So and, do you have any advice, Mom, for all those who are watching, for people who say, Well, I don't want to get the vaccine, I'm a little afraid, it hurts, it's too soon what what is your advice after well, going through the process i tell you nothing nothing is going to work unless you get this i mean you're going to regret it uh, maybe I, I think we uh, say it I again think, mama pardon can you say it again well, there was a little blip well i i just want to encourage people to go ahead and get it it's been uh recognized by all our great scientists people that know what they're doing across the world. And if it can help at all, go for it. Uh, I, I know it's a new thing, 
But we've tried new things before, and nothing ventured, nothing gained. And uh, I know I'm very glad. And I would talk with anyone who's afraid to get it, uh, who just isn't quite sure. Uh, you know, it's nothing to lose, really. It has so far, and, and I know this is going to go on even more, no one has had any ill effects, maybe a little tired. Uh, the second shot, you could be a little tired. You could be, uh, oh, maybe you're uh, upset a little, but it goes away, and and it leaves you with protection. And that's my word for vaccine, too, protection. It's like giving us the pass to go on with our life. So please think about it and do the right thing. I'm Amen. Grammy, Ayana says. Hey. Oh, Ayana. Amen. Love you, Ayana. Get you on advisor. You'd be oh, a great she's, commercial. She's one of my, buddy, my buddies there. I want to see that new house of her hers when everything gets better. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Look at Tom. We're very blessed. The word yes. protection is yep. we want to protect our loved yes. ones. So we and we just want to encourage you to get the vaccine, to sign up, to get the information wherever you live. Yes. Get on their email list so you get the notifications. I'm still getting all the Florida notifications on my phone <laughs> good. all the time. So it's good information. Yeah. And we'll be praying that you're all safe until we can all um, have this protection. And we're just so grateful for the scientists, for the frontline yes. workers. For our governors, for our, for all of our um, officials who are trying to organize this, so yes. thank yes. you, thank you all. Yes, protection. Thank you. So, are we uh, saying goodbye? The wave, the arms coming out. I think this yeah. means this is I it. I tell you something funny before we go, though. <laughs> I usually take my shower and you know the makeup I wear. I take it after the porch cast. Tonight I jumped in just before, <laughs> so you're looking at a uh, a lady who hasn't got her makeup on tonight, and I hope you looks all right. You know, I quickly. You're looking good, Mama. Makeup is not required during COVID, but the vaccine yeah. is. So I got the vaccine with no makeup. Idea. We can <laughs> live without the makeup, but we can't live without the vaccine, and be really Absolutely. happy. Okay, I want to. All right, we'll, well be back we will be week. back next Tuesday. Are you waving with your vaccine arm? Which arm is it, Mom? It's oh, your it's left this one right here. I, I, I oh, couldn't got remember it. this morning. <laughs> I okay. have a senior moment, but well, anyway. we're going to say goodbye and thank we'll you for back. tuning in. And we are just leaving you on a grateful oh, message. Yeah. Thank yes. you, God, Love for the you. vaccine. Okay, love you all. We'll see you next week. We'll see you next week.